Assalamu alaikum and greetings to everyone. You are now with me, Nadia Melissa, for TVS No News, 8 January 2018. People from all walks of life are invited to a candlelight memorial to be held in remembrance of former Chief Minister Pahin Sri Adnan Satim, who passed away on January 11 last year. The event will take place near the Darul Hana Bridge at Kuching Waterfront here this Thursday. The Kuching Traditional Handicraft Study Society and Sarawak for Sarawakians will jointly conduct the two-hour memorial scheduled to commence at 7 p.m. According to Kuching Traditional Handicraft Study Society President Robert Liu, Miri and Joho will host their own candlelight tributes events as well. Liu also advised individuals wishing to attend the memorial to put on plain and simple attire. Students may don their school uniforms for the event. He said any party flag, poster, flyer or political speech would be strictly prohibited during the service. Individuals wishing to join the memorial are advised to bring their own candles. A similar event in Miri will take place at Miri City Fan on the same date and time. For more information, call Stephen Lee at 019-855-3317. In Johor, it will be at Taman Unku Tun Aminas Kudai. Minister of Tourism, Arts, Culture, Youth and Sports Dato Abdul Karim Rahman Hamza was retained unopposed as Parti Pesaka Bumi Putra Bersatu Asajaya Branch, Chief at the Branch Triennial General Meeting on Saturday. This result means the Asajaya Assemblyman is now the branch chief for five consecutive terms since 2001. The branch also has a new deputy chief in the person of political secretary to the chief minister, Buang Bol Hassan, who defeated Oton Bujang to the post. Alui Tambi was retained unopposed as one of the branch vice presidents. The other two vice presidents are woman chief Mahani Sahari and youth chief Jamil Saidi. The branch ordinary exco members for the new term are Kasbi Idris, Sajini Sajili, Salamat Idris, Alia Sakup, Idris Saji, Jarawi Langkup, Lila Suib, Muhammad Kri, Malim Dubi, Azimen at Dolet Samad, Abang Alias, Abang Badar, Rosli Buang, Madzihi Julai, Zaini Dilah and Zawawi Kuri. Abdul Karim in his brief remarks said the lineup represented a mixture of new and old faces. He also pledged to continue serving the people to the best of his ability. A total of 1.6 million civil servants and 775,000 government pensioners will receive their special payment today, said Prime Minister Datuk Seri Najib Razak. He said the special payments will see Ringgit Malaysia 1,000 being paid for civil servants and Ringgit Malaysia 500 for government pensioners, as was announced in 2018 budget. In a Twitter posting, he said this is the first special payment of Ringgit Malaysia 1,000 for civil servants and Ringgit Malaysia 500 for pensioners, which was announced in budget 2018, will be paid on January 8. Najib announced the special payment for civil servants in the budget table on October 27 last year. He also announced in the budget that the civil servants will also receive an additional Ringgit Malaysia 500 and pensioners will receive another Ringgit Malaysia 250 special payment by Adil Fitri. And that's all from me, Nadia Melissa, for TVS No News. Thank you for watching. Stay tuned for more updates. You can watch us anytime, anywhere.